Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be setting up our Healthy Heroes for the next week. And I've got my sticker sheets ready to go. I've got my washi tape here, this uh, wellness sticker box, and the sticker books that I pulled from. Okay, so this week I was inspired to do more of a watercolor theme, kind of rainbowy, but um, just lots of color. And um, I looked into the color story, one of the color stories, and saw they had these watercolor themes going on. So to begin, I kind of pulled a couple of rainbow boxes and then just kind of added on from there, trying to figure out how I was going to incorporate that theme. And right now, uh, what I'm doing is I'm putting in headers for the workout areas that I usually do. And I basically just cut up a box sticker into six pieces and then kind of use that as, you know, decoration for my workout area. And now I'm setting up my sidebar using the habit trackers that I pulled from the wellness sticker box. Um, that's what I've been using pretty much all month as well as um, just a couple of box stickers. I was really liking the decor of these kind of crosses. So I just saw this like uh, pink corner clear sticker and I thought that it would be nice to use those crosses as kind of bullets. So I decided to cut it up and use it throughout the spread. Um, and this one will be, these little crosses will be used for my individual workouts each day, trying to denote which workouts I'm going to do. I also pulled these headers uh, describing what kind of workout I plan on doing from the Healthy Hero mini sticker book. So I'm using those to kind of create a functional area for my workouts to be tracked. And just laying in the last of those. As you guys know, Saturday's my rest day, so I just put a nice quote there to kind of break up the workout area since I won't be tracking on that day. So now that that is done, I will go ahead and move on to a little bit more decor. Just trimming out that top box sticker. And setting up more of the sidebar here putting in um, another quote and just trying to kind of design the area a little bit. I feel like I want some blue over there on the Saturday sticker, but um, I don't know. I also like that little flag that says time to rest, so we'll see. Now I am putting in my stat stickers and basically I just kind of pulled a rainbow of colors that match the watercolor theme that I'm pulling for the food log, which you'll see. They had these nice um, watercolor versions of the food log type stickers, but um, I didn't want to do them all in the watercolor because I thought it was going to be too much. so. I'm just varying it with solid and then the watercolor to kind of help break it up. Now I'm going to do a little washi in the middle. I have this neat watercolor style washi that I hardly ever use so I thought it'd be a nice uh, addition of extra color here. And when I put it in, I realized that it's going to be kind of busy over here just from looking at it. So I might make some changes there, but 
For now, I'm going to go ahead and set up my focus section using the gold crosses. And then cutting up a quote, which has been my standard lately, just kind of for ease of use and, um, you know, just to keep me focused and give a little encouragement. Do a few more cuts on this quote, kind of spread it around, hopefully so it's readable. The gold pops off the watercolor enough so that you can see it, um, but I know at certain angles it's kind of hard to see, so um, you might not be able to tell, but when you're looking at it at the right angle, they, they stand out off the washi. Now just adding a bit more of those gold crosses to kind of complete that area. And yeah, I'm looking at it and I feel like it is a little bit busy. So figure out what I want to do. I decided to use those extra crosses down here for my total calories. Just kind of denote that section and carry through the theme. And I'm one short, so I'm just going to go ahead and try to draw one in, make it look like, like the stickers. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up down below. And go ahead and leave me a comment if you'd like to get in touch. And think about subscribing to my channel if you haven't already, if you'd like to see more of my videos. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And we'll see you next time. Just coming back to show you guys that I did remove those pink headers and um, I think the spread looks a lot cleaner. So thanks again and we'll see you next time. Bye.